hopefully we'll do it a little justice today and early on the gate shooting the ball extremely well the, the midshipmen looking for their first well they get it in this possession here's jordan sugars leading scorer dishes off yes pretty uh, they can come back quickly with threes and on the make they're going to put a little token pressure and make battled injuries but voted a team captain for the second straight season and he really has been an impressive three-point shooter of Waro. Both teams getting it done right now from behind. The Pascal lost it. Heads down to the court, but was not able to come up with the ball. And now Navy looking to connect. And the midshipmen do precisely that. Jordan Sugars. The stroke is sweeter than the name there. He backs the defense off and trans. There he is, and aware that the defense overplayed a little bit, gives a head fake, and right underneath using the window. Mark Vizi, his first bucket of the game. Statistically, he's their best field goal. We'll be tracking that all afternoon. OJ Aguaro kicks it out to Greg Brown. Pretty. Greg Brown who's bided his time, according to Coach Lang. A streaky shooter, one for eight on Wednesday, but doing pretty well so far today. He was an assistant at Navy from 1987 to 1998, so he's familiar with the leadership of midshipmen as Navy pulls inexorably closer. That's Savoro. Doing a great job getting off the screens, or setting solid screens first and foremost, and then finding the open shooter. And... On the cusp of taking the lead, the midshipmen do. J.J. Avila. Well, they hung around, and now they're taking advantage of those turnovers. One of the great teams in Section 3 history, I would say. Jordan Sugars, the team's leading scorer, held on to it and sets up his teammate, Romeo Garcia. Easy bucket, and then they set the pressure up. And threes uh, that year, but... His junior campaign was marred by injury, and he missed eight games this season with an injury. O.J. Avuaro gives Navy the lead right back. Yeah, that was, that was half down. Well, bad break there. Pretty. I mean, that is as pretty as that gets. Jordan Sugars. Yeah, he comes off that screen just ready to go. It shows you his range. It's a tough shot when your body's not facing the basket. You have all the game. Mark Vizi wants to take a shot. Oh, how did that go in? That is, uh, are you kidding? Really? I mean, that was down around his waist. 40 seconds in count. Brennan Wyatt taking his time. Sugars gives Navy the lead right back. Shot clock off. Well, they got great contributions off the bench. Jordan Sugars makes it look easy. Yeah. One of those guys, no matter where he catches, you know, five, six feet behind that line, that is not out of his range. And the real stone. Fewer than 30 Raiders have ever hit the 1,000 mark. And that's Sugars. Those are the plays that really drive coaches batty. When you get that good of a look from underneath your basket in the first half, they're rearing their ugly head again here in the second for Colgate. And you, see, you see what Navy does. They create a turnover on one end. They capitalize on the other. Lupus. Pure. Yep, straight on look. Nobody in his mug. That's an easy shot for him. Jordan Sugars, he's at four personals. And it's in. Great take to the basket. He, he's a tough guy to handle. You respect the jump shot. You get up close. He uses the dribble off a great high screen around the free throw line. Standing right in front of us. To Rose. Time expiring. Rolls takes a shot. OT. It's up for a shot. Rebound. Brown lays it in. And that's a critical bucket. Yep. It brings Navy to within two. Brown trying to get open. Wyatt is in the game. He's running the point for Navy. 
Avila turns, shoots at scores. Pascal has to play a little softer with that fourth foul, and you see there. Perfect. And we're tied again. Under the basket. And Wyatt is milking this clock. Now he hands off to Roberts, who pulls up. Roberts off the mark. Venezia to Hoban. Well. Two for seven. Past regulation. And a great steal by Roberts and Sugars comes back down the other way and lays it in. Great take to the basket. I mean, Roberts, but Rolls comes away with the ball. Stolen away by Brown. Greg Brown takes it. And scores. Good keep. You see how the defense backed off and didn't take away his dribble. That's a good decision. 73-68. Fortunes have changed here. Roberts pretty much puts it out of reach. Colgate, okay, plenty of time. Go the length of the court and get a decent shot. Obviously, if he makes this free throw, it gives him a chance to, to set up shop a little bit and keeps the clock still. Ja Wu's back in, Moore heads out. This free throw would make it five for six for Sugars today. Indeed. Well, this is Venezia territory. But it's Rolls who takes the shot. Navy holds on 81 to 78 in double OT. What a game at Cotterill Court. Incredible game. I mean, they just went at one another, a couple extra sessions, and maybe hangs on at the end there, but an exciting finish. I mean, this game.